A potential breakthrough in the fight to protect our children from COVID-19. A new study from researchers at Johns Hopkins University shows that rapid tests may be the key to keeping children safe and schools open. Welcome to WJZ News at 11 and to all of you streaming tonight. I'm Denise Koch. Well, after a previous study showed that rapid tests may not be as effective delivering accurate test results, tonight this new study by Johns Hopkins shows that rapid tests are highly accurate when it comes to detecting COVID-19 in children. These results could definitely be a game changer for local school districts. WJZ is live right now. Christina Mendez walks us through the study results and explains some of the advantages of these rapid tests. Christina. Researchers say that these rapid tests, well, they're a whole lot quicker. You get results back in about 15 minutes and you can do them yourselves. Those are some of the benefits. It also saves time and money. This versus a PCR test, we know that that could take anywhere from a day or more to get back, and those are done by a lab technician. Researchers with Johns Hopkins had interest in finding out how accurate rapid tests are when comparing results to the gold standard PCR. For seven months, the home of the study was at the Baltimore Convention Center Field Hospital. We had a thousand children who come in, came in and participated in our study. They got the usual PCR study, and they also had a second swab done for a rapid antigen study. Researcher Jashan Siddiqui says the results of the study for both symptomatic and asymptomatic children should give parents and school administrators more trust in rapid tests. Amongst the cases that we found using PCR, 90% of those were detected by the rapid antigen test. Siddiqui believes this could play an important role in allowing students to limit their absences from school while in quarantine or waiting for their PCR test results to come back, something student Anissa Allen is familiar with. It felt like the results were getting back too slowly. I feel pretty happy about the research because uh, knowing results of a coronavirus test faster will make it easier for um, us to find out uh, who has it and exactly what measures can be taken. Faster, accurate, rapid test results coupled with the ability to test in schools and with millions of at-home rapid tests soon to be available this week through the Biden administration initiative, researchers say this could help overcome testing disparities for children in medically underserved communities. The way I see the value of this study is, especially in these days when COVID is so prevalent, there are a number of layers of safety that we have. We have masking. Researchers do add that a negative rapid COVID test, those should not replace those COVID-19 precautions that the researcher was just mentioning. As for those federal government tests being provided, you can get one starting on Wednesday at covidtest.gov. I'm reporting live in Baltimore tonight. I'm Christina Mendez for WJZ.